let's go. You you don't understand how much redstone that takes because you'd have to have drop you would have to have a dropper or a um it's actually a special uh, um box that would drop it and you gotta do it in a very specific order otherwise it won't accept it if the last thing isn't the crop is the, the proper thing you could do it in almost any order but if you do it in a weird order and then the last one falls it actually won't do it it'll just put it in there and it has to be so fast otherwise you'll start losing stuff as well there does a few things to go along with it. I can't hear you, Charlie. You're breaking up. Good for you. Okay, so add to and remove energy. Energy from the core. You need to place energy pylons within 15 blocks of the core to activate. To activate a pylon, place a glass block either above or below it. Depending on whether the pylon is placed below or above the core. If you place the pylon on your floor, you would place the glass block under it. When the glass, blocks, when the glass block is placed, the pylon should immediately be activated and link with the nearby energy core. The link is indicated by, by white light. Um, energy particle and glass should change should change okay. render shown by the image above. <sighs> okay. Do we have enough Shift machina? right click the pylon to change the core. It is linked to if there is more than one core. Energy is added and removed from the core using energy pylons. I have pylons. Oh yeah, yeah. We got more than enough of everything. All I gotta do is just... Oh wait, <laughs> silly me, I was almost ready to start. But I forgot two of the most important ingredients. Which is? The filter to sentia funnels. Uh, yeah, that would be pretty damn bad. Okay, yep. Yeah. So I need some glass. Probably needs to be normal Minecraft glass too. What are you doing? Oh, you're making the um, essence thingy. Have you seen my giant ball of um, purple yet? No. Okay, good. Oh, now I do. Ironically, despite the massive use of power that this, uh, no, wait, not massive use of power, massive it's, it's drink power, power that this provides, it's actually just a normal infusion. It's not even dangerous. Okay, good. Now that I have the Essentia provider, all that I have to do is stick it to the bottom of the, uh, machine and attach the essential tubes. Trying to remember the force backup command. Okay then. Now I need to get those 
those big, uh, big crazy wires. Wait, actually, what kind of wi uh, wire connects up to your uh, normal? Uh, nothing connects to the normal altar. It connects to the um, ascent, not the ascent, the um, infusion provider, which is a basic ME cable. You can get over there with the Ender IO conduits, but you have to use a bait. You have to use an ME cable to actually connect to it. Otherwise, it will not work. Okay. It's kind of weird. Okay, it's admin. Okay, world has been backed up. Hold on. It is still backing up. It's still backing up. Huh? Why has it been backed up? Because I'm about to turn this damn thing on. I'm waiting for it to finish. The command console has said it's not done. What are you doing, oh. Cassie? What? I you know, like that clicking noise. What'd you do, Alex? Ah, oh, son of a bitch. Son of a biscuit. Did you use dense cable or did you use normal cable? Uh, no, no, no. Uh, I made a whole... A whole what? Yeah, I accidentally broke one of your next crystal monsters. Oh, make sure you put it back. Ah, uh, well. Come on, finish saving. 91% we must have reached our base because it slowed down at 91 ooh pretty why'd you go that way why don't you just hook up to the normal um, ME cable that's right because here I don't know where the fuck the normal ME cable is Charlie you don't tell me these things. You went straight to it. Any ME cable goes to the ME system. They all do. Just, just, just shut up. Backup finish is at 94.81%. God, that looks like a ball of death. Is about to happen. I don't want to start it till the world is done backing up. Are you just blow everything up? I don't know. That's why I'm backing the world up right now. Definitely. That's why I'm. F that's why I forced the world back up. Where were you for supper? I don't know. Yeah, I was about to ask. No, no. Want to go to the mall? Yeah. I don't care. Spin that stop a hundred times. Again. <laughs> Backup is done. 2.1 gigabytes. What, what are we doing? Keeping Alex away from the candy store. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Why does it sound like Charlie has an uncomfortable erection in front of children now? Oh no, I ain't having that. I, I'm fairly certain you don't. Just, just... Oh my god! Why did you do that? Why did... Why did who do that? Cassie teleported to me. Right in my face as I'm trying to place an item very sensitively. I don't even know when it's going to turn on. Whenever I try to place it on top or bottom, it gives me, even on the side, it gives me, uh... You know what's sad? What? You two are probably going to get the full blast of it, and I'm just going to be sitting here watching like, wow. You know you're going to be off the map as well. Our whole base will be gone. If this thing Why blows up. Why are you making this thing? The risk does not outweigh the reward, Charlie. It absolutely does. No, it really doesn't. It does. I want to see it. 
It looks cool, and it holds an infinite amount of energy. We will never fill this thing up, and we will never use it all. And then I'm probably going to build the generator some far off fucking place somewhere else. Probably in a different dimension. <laughs> because it generates so much power. However, I cannot get it to place this damn block. It said place a glass of block. Am I nuts? I'm not nuts, I swear. Now you're insane. That's the wretch, ritual of resurrection. Seven tiers capable. Energy core consists of energy core blocks surrounded by four particle generators. Generators must be directly in line with the core as shown in the following images. Generator must be placed within ten blocks of the core. Yes, the ten blocks of the core. These may be too far away, then. The core is right here in the center. This is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No, that's nine blocks right there. No, this right here would be exactly ten, because I placed four cobblestone blocks. Okay, um... Generator must be placed within 10 blocks of the core. Uh, the core is then surrounded by a combination of redstone draconium blocks following the images configuring them within the capacity once. Okay, so tier 1 already holds 45.5 million RF, by the way. That's, that's tier 1. We're on tier 7, which holds uh, 2.14 trillion RF. Then 15 blocks, of course, so I um, guess tier 7 needs 15. Activate the pylon. Place a glass of block either below or above. Sorry, above or below, depending, depending on whether the pylon is placed below or above the core. Place the pylon on your roof. You would place on your roof. You would place the glass. I am so confused. It said on my floor earlier, unless I'm, I must be just that damn dyslexic. Okay, maybe I need to put a block down below it. Oh, yeah, that's probably my problem because I literally can't even place that there. That didn't activate it. I'm just waiting for the explosion, the immediate reset. With screams of Charlie going, oh no! As if he honestly didn't expect this to happen. Alright, back to Google. Draconic F I L U T I O N. Energy core. How do I activate the damn thing? Someone help me. Okay, this right here might actually give me something. Okay, uh, extreme amount of RF values depending on middle mid to end game structure that is available after wither killing which we have clearly done way before <laughs> to activate the core shift right click one of the particle generators with an empty hand to add to add and remove energy from the core pylons. Okay, so. Okay, so I need to use an empty hand on it to activate them, but I have to place the glass under it first. Cassie's just waiting for the explosion. And the I told you so's and the. 
God damn it, Charlie's and the. I mean, I, this is exactly why I've made a manual backup of the world, like, a second ago. Before I even placed these damn things. I made a backup of the world. So, empty hand. That didn't give me shit. Just bring the. No, enable on. No. Core. No. Take note value. Need paper and inventory to do that. Okay, I finished the wiring. The, um. Thomic Horizons, uh. Uh huh. Just simply tank adjust is the field. Now completely integrated with the ME system. Generic particle looks and behave. This block is a work in progress. New features and particles are likely to be added in future versions. The following list of fields and what they do. First field, three fields, red, blue, green, color. Uh, yes. It's motion. Modified runic matrix has been added. Of stabilizing mixed crystal clusters. No signal is required for the generator to run. However, it will. However, if you shift right click on the generator with an empty hand, it will switch to invert mode. The redstone signal. Um, the red. The redstone mode is indicated by eight cubes. Um, the corner of the block can be controlled via a computer. So it's shift right click. Oh. God, that was exhausting. There you go. Ooh, pretty. It's not as awesome as I thought it would be. Right. I Two. hope. I hope no. Nope. I'm running. Bye, bitches. Well, nice knowing you, Alex. We're all about to die. Why? I'm joking. There's no power in it yet. I'm not even. It's not. It doesn't generate power. It just holds power. I haven't built the generator. The generator itself will probably be somewhere else. Tether. So is it not going to blow up? Uh, not right now because it has no power in it. And then I need to do a... What was it called? Yeah. No, I'm not done. I am. Energy pylons. G. G. High lines. I need two of these. Hey Cassie, come see what I'm working on. I'm over here by Charlie's idiotic nether portal. This is a very special curative vat. I'm going to be able to infuse animals with magic once I get it up and running. You, you could also put her in there and infuse her with magic. Uh, yes. Well, there is just one problem with that. You're not likely to survive the process. Usually you have to die. Not to mention, uh, well... Actually, uh, uh, well, the thing about it is, in order to... The thing what? about it is, in order to do that, you, uh, first you have to infuse the dead body that you put in there, and after that... That should be enough. After that, what? You should make me magical. <laughs> I I could, but I would need a lot of resources to do. Firstly, firstly, I'm gonna need to make a. Um, let me let me see what the item is called. I can make you magical, Cassie, but uh, it comes at a heavy price. I thought you, I thought you was gonna yeah. say. Firstly, I'm gonna need Charlie to stop killing dragons. Uh, well, that was actually on my mind, but uh, that's not the only thing. 
Um, let me see. Where is the soul grinder? Where is it? Where is it? Where is the... Ah, yes, uh, I need a soul beacon which requires a warded jar, two void metal ingots, two eyes of ender, a beacon, and a primordial pearl. In a very high instability arcane infusion. I'll try to... Oh. I'm not done. Well, it's not like you're not going to play against me. I'm not. Yeah, he's playing God of War. <laughs> I didn't even need to make four. I could have easily gotten away with only um. But yeah, I could make you magical, <sighs> Cassie, but it would require a lot of effort, and it would only last so long as you're still alive in your current body. But let me tell you what I could do to you. Uh, firstly, I could make you incredibly fast, jump high, uh, yeah, so, first infusion's called Quicksilver Limbs, um, oh, I'm, I'm just gonna have to do that later, I'm gonna have to set up the power transfer yeah, to it later it then. it requires Quicksilver, Damn Void it. Metal, Potions of Swiftness, uh, I could also make you, uh, Awakened Blood. Which will basically make you heal a lot faster. Why are you doing that? I could give you diamond flesh, giving you the average strength of diamond armor without any armor actually on. Um, Silverwood heart. Charlie? I had to go kill one more. I didn't have enough. Just yeah, one more. Would heart, though, I could use to make you immune to taint and uh, things like that. Yeah, because that's uh, what that's definitely what she needs to be is immune to taint. Ah, uh, yes, synth skin. Um, this would actually be very useful for you. Basically, if all of us got the synth skin enchantment, we would never be hungry again so long as we stayed outside. Um, I don't starve anyway, or I can't starve to death anymore. I could starve, but not to death. Yeah. I like all the food that y'all need. I know. Technically, this would just turn us into human plant people. Which is fine, too. Oh, so it'll turn us vegetarian. Uh, no, it turns us into lightitarians. All we would have to do is stand in direct sunlight, and we would be able to get food. Our hunger meter would be felt. Uh, let's see. Morphic Fingers. This one could be useful. Uh, it actually lets you have a portable crafting table in your hand. Ooh, I like that. Yeah. Yeah, Morphic Fingers. It's actually not the worst of all the enchantments I could do. It just requires two void metal, an arcane crafting table, a balance shard, and the empty shell, which anyone will tell you is not... The empty shell is quite a difficult thing to have. So, I could make you magical within the next few sessions, Cassie. It'd just take a little bit of work. In I the like meantime... Yeah. yeah. Uh, in the meantime, I'm going to get a few more of Charlie's arcane pedestals and start setting them up. Probably need to. Okay, so. What the hell? What? I'm supposed to be in recipe mode. Okay, arcane stone blocks. Yeah, it's just arcane stone blocks. Yeah, it shouldn't be very hard. 
Oh, I could also make us all breathe water. I don't have that problem either. To be immediately activated and linked with the nearby energy core, the link is indicated by white energy particles, and the glass should change to what was that? That's pylon. Outgoing, incoming, and this is building energy. That's not too bad. We're already at 10 million on this thing. But is, and that, that is receiving and sending energy because it's sending energy from the Tesseract to the thing, so we're probably draining our energy out of the cells, but we're also storing it in a much more efficient environment. That could also kill us at any time. I expected a Charlie, you son of a bitch. Yeah, we're, we're going to no, be draining that soon. Going to call you a Probably. Either way, this is Mods of Sam saying, I hope y'all have enjoyed this, and I will see y'all next time. Bye. Fuck all y'all, YouTube. We're making a Franken monster. Yeah, this actually does look look pretty nice. See ya.